Well, this is the final race from Royal Ascot. It's two mile and five. Martin, I bet you're happy you're not doing this one. Penny Fair Monty for David Ladd four to one. Maurice Sadie for David Ladd nine to one. Take back control for Grey ten to three favourite. Strawberry Mist and Crop Duster for Paul Parsons twelve to one at nine to two. And Prize Princess for Nick seven to one. Six go to post for the Queen Alexander. And they're off. We're going to start slowly here, given it's two miles and five, and no one wants to take it up, unsurprisingly. They're all poodling along with Crop Duster and Strawberry Mist for Paul Parsons, the two that do take it to the front. Take back control, doesn't fancy control today, then is going to sit in third with Penny Fan, Monty, Marie Sadie and Price Princess. Strawberry Mist has decided to do the donkey work for Crop Duster and takes probably a two length gap out of the field here. Penny Fan Monty has moved up into second and Price Princess is now up into fourth with Take Back Control and Marie Sadie now at the back of the pack. They come up the home straight for the first time. The two Paul Parsons horses are in front. I think it's been a good role I've got for him from what I've seen, a few winners, so another one on the board will definitely be nice for him. Prize Princess is in third. It's been a shock of a Royal Ascot for Nick, so he'll be looking for a winner here if possible. Penny Fan Monty in fourth. Take back control for Gray in fifth, being pushed along a little bit there. Marie Sadie is happy to sit at the back there in sixth. Strawberry Mist, probably about three lengths in front now. Nothing really wants to go with Strawberry Mist. They are, they are going at a relatively reasonable pace. It's not too quick, but it's not that slow either. As they come past the finishing post, one mile six left to go. This is going to drag out, I feel. Strawberry Mist, three, three and a half in front of Crop Duster. Penny Fan Monty, Prize Princess. Take back control has been pushed along quite a bit here and is not sure if he's struggling to keep pace with the rest of the pack. But Marie Sadie is hard on the snap at the back of the pack. Uh, is now being ridden along to try and get a little closer. Gap's probably open to four now. Oh, Rain's being pulled on the leader. Strawberry Mist wants to get the breather as they go down into Swinley Bottom. Crop Duster has also let second go to Penny Fan Monty, and the other three have been ranged out wide to try and get a little bit of a better position as they go in to the bottom of the track there. Strawberry Mist still in front, probably at only about two and a half now to Penny Fan Monty, Crop Duster. Take back control, Prize Princess and Marie's Sadie at the back still. Nine furlongs left to go. We are getting there slowly but surely as we go towards the final mile. Strawberry Mist, it's Penny Fan Monty now in second. Crop Duster is into third and the other three are pretty much neck and neck at the back of the pack. This looks like they're all being ridden to try and get a bit closer now as they go into the seven furlong point. Strawberry Mist is probably about two, two and a half still to Penny Fan Monty. Crop Duster now being told to get closer. Maurice, Sadie and Take Back Control are also moving to get closer. And Crop Duster has decided he's had enough of his pacemaker, Strawberry Mist, and is going to range alongside as they go toe to toe. They don't really want to be cutting each other's throats here. There's some dangers in behind the two. David had horses and Grace horse there as well. They are, they can be very dangerous. And we go down towards the four furlong point. We're coming close to the home bend. It's just about to start off now. Strawberry Mist is still going well, just under a length from Crop Duster, who's now getting closer. Penny Fan Monty here is take back control for Grey. Marie Sadie is also coming with a run, but it's take back control for Grey, who is going to be the big challenger. Crop Duster has dropped away. Strawberry Mist is still in front. It's a long way up the home stretch here, and take back control for Grey. He loves his stayers. They do well here, and take back control has wrestled control from the Paul Parsons pair. Marie Sadie is trying to get into second.
second, but take back control. It's flying up the home straight. The other two are beat. Penny Van Monte is trying to get closer. The two ball Parsons horses are beat here. It's down to Marie Sadie to try and catch take back control. But I think that's beyond all chances here. Take back control has done more than enough. Into the final stages. It's relatively easy here. It's take back control for Gray. A nice, easy winner for Gray. Those stayers really do come alive. And he's managed to get a Royal Ascot winner here. Take back control, does it well. Your 9 to 4 favourite. Maurice Sadie, second at 12 to 1. Crop Duster, third at 7 to 1. Strawberry Mist, fourth, 20 to 1. And Penny Van Monty, fifth at 13 to 2.